hey what's up so random project here I had a buddy actually give me this treadmill because it was broken um, the motor still works and what I'm actually doing here is making the motor uh, produce electricity by walking on it so the treadmill itself isn't plugged in in fact I'm actually generating electricity just by walking on the treadmill so I'm kind of using it in reverse now I wanted to see could I watch TV just off the power that I'm generating at the time I'm not storing any electricity I'm just powering real time this TV so it's hooked up to an antenna behind it and you can see sure enough it works now to do this it's not rocket science I just thought it would be fun to show kind of how easy it is. Now this DC motor is generally powered so that it makes the treadmill work. I obviously don't have it plugged in for this kind of project. Instead, I am actually taking the positive and negative leads of the motor and I have wired that to my own electronics. The motor outputs to this buck boost converter which basically evens out the output voltage to a preset voltage which I've preset it to about 13 volts into a, an, an inverter which is designed to take DC power and convert it to AC. I've got that plugged straight into the TV panel and straight into my antenna here. To give you an idea of what kind of voltage the motor outputs you can hook up a multimeter straight to it which I've done here and see that the voltage coming out of it is dependent on what kind of speed I am walking or running at. You can go up all the way up to about 40 volts and the inverter needs you know 12 or 13 volts to run properly. The buck converter I use is what basically takes that higher voltage input and that varying voltage input and outputs a consistent you know, 12 or 13 volts. Without that converter you would put in a higher voltage into the inverter and as I did once because the buck converter I used failed it exploded one of the capacitors inside the inverter. So I knew I could power just the TV and I wanted to see what else can I power at the same time. I hooked up three LED bulbs which are 10 watts a piece to the inverter along with the TV and I was surprised it all still worked. Now it gets harder to actually walk on the treadmill the more current that you're needing to produce and that is something that may be not obvious here but it definitely is harder to actually walk depending on how much power you're drawing. Now I don't know how this information can help you but it was fun. It's fun to see how easy it is. And if you want to see more projects of mine, please subscribe or like this video.